unajua actually wote nimeshinda uh, kwanza kabla kabla sijashinda the main the main issue ilikuwa ni mbona kampuni yangu and everything paka sasa hivi that was the main plan ilikuwa tuna plan kwamba nilikuwa natakiwa nikae angalau mwezi huu mmoja ndani ya big brother nikae ndani ya mwezi mmoja ndio kwa nimepata uh, the influence pamoja na unajua the coverage itakuwa najulikana nchi nyingi kwa ni kija kurudi kwa kuanzisha kampuni yangu advertisement itakuwa ni rais na mimi itakuwa ni speed up kila kitu kitakuwa kinafanya kazi haraka haraka kwa hiyo the main plan ya mimi kuingia ilikuwa kwanza sio kuchukua hela ilikuwa the main plan ni mimi kukaa at least one month ilikuwa ni for the platform kwa hiyo mimi kuja kushinda as your question unavyosema kwamba imenisaidiaje ime ndani na nje ya nchi kwamba imeweza kunifunulia trust unajua siku hizi kufanya kazi mi, na, na ideology ambayo kazi yoyote ambayo inazidi milioni kumi inaanza kuwa personal everything inakuwa ni personal na kile chochote ambacho kinakuwa personal inabidi mtu aweze kukutrust na kukutrust inabidi watu waweze kujua kama mimi wananiona na a lot to lose watu wanaoaminika wengi waga ni wale wenye a lot to lose kama mimi najua familia yako najua napokaa najua nini kwa unajua kabisa ukikimbia najua familia yako si najua nini najua utakupata wapi kwa you have a lot to lose umeshaona kwa hiyo ndio ni rais kwa mimi kuanza kukuamini wewe kufanya naye kazi kwa hiyo imenisaidia mimi kuanza kupata the whole platform na kazi zangu zinakuwa rais sasa hivi same nikienda na ijadi ku pitch kwa jia kufanya kazi gani nahitaji kwa jia kwenda kuonana na mtu fulani na kwa ni rais kusema tu it's Idris akiingia Google akis search oh it's Idris and oh it's easy for me kwa hiyo imenipa the whole the whole major platform ambayo nayo mimi sasa hivi it's a potential ambayo natakiwa niweze kuitumia kwa sasa hivi na hisi kama nimeitumia kwa asilimia chache sana bado naweza kuitumia so this year 2016 naanza kuitumia maisha baada ya kupata umaarufu yamekuwa ni magumu na marais in such uh, ugumu wake ni uwezi kuishi kama binadamu wa kawaida hiyo ndio ugumu wake kama sasa hivi siwezi nikasimama nika nikatoka ubungo nikatua pale nikanunua mwindi ambao na utamani kweli na nikatoka na mwindi wangu nikaondoka kwa amani haiwezekani yani it's not possible kabisa nikaweza kushika ngafanya kitu kama hicho lakini yani ndo that part ndo naongelea kusema kwamba yani kuna vitu ambavyo siwezi kufanya kuna vitu siwezi kufanya kama kuweza um, kuniona hii distance tembea barabarani inshallah inaanza kuzua vitu vingi vya ajabu ajabu ambavyo it is out of nowhere oh mara mefika oh mara sijui imekuwa nini oh it is yani kuna magazeti tutakuta aibu hakuto akitembea yani <laughs> yani vitu vya ajabu ajabu vinazuka just for the work umeshaona kwa hiyo siwezi hatuwezi kufanya the ordinary na hii ni kwa sababu ya umeshawekwa sehemu ambayo watu wanahitaji ku kuchukua mengi kutoka kwako. Kwa hiyo kwa bit more careful na vitu ambavyo unavyofanya wewe katika basic. Lakini ingawaje ni vitu ambavyo vya kawaida vya binadamu vya kufanya lakini huwezi kuvifanya kama hivyo. Vitu vya kawaida ambavyo naweza kuvifanya hata sasa hivi naweza ngasimama labda sema kwenye TV nikachana nywele. Kitu sasa mechana nywele. Was the game chana nywele au nini umechana. Lakini faida zake kubwa ni kama na kama hivyo unasema Uh, watu wengi wanakuamini unakuwa una a lot of, 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 of support na, na, na fa, kutoka kwenye fan base yako kutokana na kwa manikianzisho chochote najua kabisa kama sasa hivi na followers labda laki saba, laki nane, milioni moja najua tayari na watu milioni moja ambao wanaangalia kazi yangu tayari ninakuwa na assurance kwamba na support ya watu milioni moja either labda tuseme labda wale laki mbili wanani follow pale unaweza kwa watu labda ni wale mtu mmoja anaenda hapo lakini unajua kabisa na assurance ya watu fulani ambao i have supporters kuliko mtu mwingine wa kawaida akianzisha kitu chake anaanza from the beginning na pia my contact inakuwa ni kubwa na inakuwa ni rahisi kwa mimi kuweza ku walk into any office nikasema i'm idris umeshaona na ndoka sema oh it's idris na wakaweza kunikabidhi vitu fulani vya kuweza kufanya nao kama i want to do work with them umeshaona kwa hiyo hiyo faida kubwa ni sana sana pande huo it comes to business na um, plans zangu ambitions zote ambazo nataka kuziachieve inakuwa ndrais kwa watu kuweza kunisaidia lakini kwenye kuishi kawaida na vitu kama hivyo inakuwa inakuwa ni tabu inakuwa ni tabu tuseme yani kama sasa hivi tu ikitokea ni ghafla tu gari yangu imeisha mafuta mseme niko hapo barabarani nikatoka nikaanza kushika kidumu katembea shako tatizo lakini binadamu ngine akaenda oh jamaa anaenda kuchukua maji lakini Idris anaenda kuchukua dumu kwa sababu hivi naisha maifuta kiakisha barabarani na chomona plate number ziweke ndani ya gari natoka na vaa kofia naenda na nua zile na ni kama za sudi brown na chucha na tembea nikiingia peto station nikirudi nikuja mafuta nikioka narudishia plate number tena upya sababu tunaijua gari yangu 
for a video camera review. So it, it may affect it may affect my life. In in such a Tanzania ya, ya comedy, it's very very low in Tanzania. Uh, na kuweza kuangalia hichi kitu kuna vitu vingi sana kama mimi wakati naanza naanza comedy yani ni kama yani unaweza kusema na force so kumbe una force lakini watu wanahitaji kuelewa kwamba hakuna maana ya pili nyuma ya kile unachokisema unachokiona kama mimi sasa hivi nikiona diamond amedondoka ameleza amedondoka nikamtania kwenye utani kwamba labda ni ni kitu cha kidogo let's say let's say amedondoka stageini nikasema labda tu alipigiwa simu akaambiwa labda tifa sio mtoto wake umeshaona akadondoka stageini lakini nikisema out of nowhere watu wana, wanaona ah ujamaa basi atakuwa na beef na diamond labda ujamaa atakuwa labda sijui anachochea ana, ana vitu vya ajabu no umeshaona kama yeye comedian una set something basi iko pale tu na watu watacheka mtu wa kawaida akisema hivyo mtaani watu wanacheka lakini mimi nikisema just because I'm a public figure wanachukulia kama itakuwa personal au vitu kama hivyo kwa hiyo ilichukua muda mrefu sana kwa watu kuja kuelewa kwamba nikisema kitu it's just plain job umeshaona kwa hiyo nilitumia muda mrefu sana sababu imetumia kama mwaka mzima actually imetumia kama mwaka mzima paka watu kuja kuelewa okay it is ni comedian umeona na hichi kitu alikuwa anatania hiyo ni baada ya kufanya vitu vingi sana kuleta hii kuleta ile kuparangana kuna posti nyingi sana nimezifuta una posti watu wanakuja ndani wanachukia wanakereka wengine watacheka walioelewa wengine basi paka sasa hivi ndio watu wanaanza kuelewa sasa inakuja pole pole sasa i think hii na face watu wengi mimi kama mimi nimeamua kukomaa unaona nimekomaa nayo paka nimeweza kueleweka lakini kuna watu wengine hapa katikati tu wakipata vile vipingamizi na nini watu wameshamtukana tukana sana nini na nini anakata tamaa anaamua kufanya kitu kingine ndio maana ukiona hata uh, comedy nyingi mbozi kwa Tanzania wakiwa anafanya kitu kuhusiana na mtu fulani wote tunajua anatania kuhusu mtu fulani lakini hasemi jina umeshaona lakini kwa nini usiseme jina umeshaona we both know nani unaemuongelea unaogopa nini umeshaona kuna freedom of speech unaongelea kitu fulani kama unajijua hichi kitu unaongea ni kama utani and it is just plain unaongea kawaida looking at comedians kama USA UK wote wanaofanya Unasimama stage ni unatania vitu vikubwa umeshaona na unasema names of people na hao watu ndio tunawaangalia we saying we want to be like them umeshaona kwa hiyo kwa nini tuanze kuogopa tunaanza kutania unasema let's say unataka kumtania abda kinje kitile lakini utaanza kusema ah kuna mzee mmoja bana sijui ana miaka ya moja sijui ana chama ana dini hana nini umeshaona unaanza kujakunja vitu vingi sana but you can just say it plainly umeshaona because people know one so confidence pia comedians now imekuwa inakuwa crushed kwa sababu pia watu wanachukua vitu bias kwa kama mimi watu na sometimes wanaingia kwenye post zangu wasema mmm mwanangu utapigwa umeshaona to which no watu mimi naongea nao ndio kuna baadhi ya watu ambao ndio nimewatania na wanaweza kawa wame wamekasirika in one way or the other lakini kwa sababu na wapi hawakuelewa ideology na sasa hivi they are okay with me kuwatania because unawaelimisha na wao so i think that's the main issue kwa kwa mimi kusema kama na mpango gani wa kuikuza tasnia um in one way or the other ni kuweza kuwa tofauti mimi nakuja kitu tofauti mimi kama mimi nafanya smart comedy na just ya kuvaa manguo au kufanya nini au si nikaanza kuongea lugha tofauti au sauti tofauti au nini no 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 mimi nakuja straight plain kwamba nitashusha situational comedy tunaita situational comedy na political comedy na vitu kama hivyo i'm coming smart nitasimama nimevaa labda suti yango nini nitaongea vitu people will laugh or people will not laugh that is how i'm going to come kwa hiyo na, na mpango kufika mbali na nitaanzisha shows kubwa kutoka kuna concerts kubwa za comedy nitakuwa na shows kwenye TV kwa BET pamoja na vuzu ambazo a lot of comedians watakuja watakuja kujoin to which hiyo ndio mpango ambao napanga kwa kuweza kuwakuza baada big brother actually na kampuni na kampuni mbili ambazo zimeniweka very busy the first company ni ni 3 ambayo ni advertising company ambayo inafanya photography inafanya videography graphic design mambo ya marketing pamoja na all the billboards na vitu kama hivyo pia tulishirikia kampeni ya CCM the whole kampeni ya CCM tulikuwa tunashirikia sisi uh, tumefanya a lot of big jobs also i'm referring to CCM kwa sababu ni the, the, the recent one ambayo imetokea 
So that is, um, that is, that is my company, that is the first company, the financial advertising. Alafu, um, second company, ni mining company, number that has just started this year. I'm going to show you here for like one full year. I'm going to make a lot of money for the quick fish up a little bit. What's the same with this year? It's mining. I'm going to make a lot of gold. I mean, was, but by the meantime, I'm going to concentrate on gold mostly. And I talk larics. Those are the two companies I'm going to make a lot of money. 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 I'm going to make a lot of they start asking themselves, mm, mm, ah. <laughs> No, we have plans, Mona. Na, a lot of plans, na easy plans, na sinaweza kunifanya mimi, nikaweza kudream. Kama nikisema leo na amuka na tegimia kununua muindi, muindi ni shingapi, ni shingi miatano. Then in my mind, na jijua kabisa leo nita tengeneza F1 miatano. Kwa nita kuwa na miatano extra, ya kuweza kuja kununua muindi. Kwa nita kuwa na kununua private jet, private jet shingapi dola milioni moja. Then in my mind, ni na dola milioni tano. Nishawana? So that is how it will work. So these are the companies that I'm going to make me busy. Okay, channel na iyo, na TV shows that I'm going to make me busy on prep. For a very long time, kuna shows, kuna reality shows that I'm going to make me busy on BET. Kuna shows that I'm going to make me busy on TV locally. Kuna shows that I'm going to make me busy on Africa and Zima on DSTV. So these are the shows that I'm going to make me busy on TV for a long time. So, to go to the last stages, I'm going to make me busy on TV.